New at six, we all know summer camp is an American tradition or a rite of passage for most kids. But for those who are blind or visually impaired, it can be a rare and a true life changing experience. Katie Crowther shows us how two local groups are making sure that every child gets a chance to go. <laughs> there is joy around every corner at the Albert and Ann Desher Rainbow Day Camp in Ozaki County. I've been coming here for four years and I am never stopping. I love this. Bryce Jensen doesn't get the chance to play sports back home. Shout out to I Racine. Love Racine. I had the honor of cheering on him and others for the day. Go Bennett. Go Bennett. Yeah. While they played adaptive tennis, kickball. Go, 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 go. Here it comes towards you. Straight. Go. Yeah. And so much more. They were proud to show their skills. This little girl was going to take a break, but in sign language told her counselor, the camera is here. We have to stay. Rainbow Day Camp is owned and operated by the Harry and Rose Sampson Jewish Community Center, which in partnership with the Vision Forward Association makes this four day sports camp possible and free for visually impaired children and teens from all over Wisconsin. You met each other yeah, at camp this other. year? Yeah, and we have a friend group called the Foxes. It uh, makes you feel like uh, you um, don't have to face the world alone. For longtime camp okay, director right. Lenny Cass, okay. that's what it's all about. This is why I do this work. It's to see kids smiling and seeing kids be able to be kids. A place where friendship, fun, and confidence grow. A lot of times, like, I just sit at home and don't do anything, but this camp gives me something to do for a week. I could hang out with my friends and have fun. People it, get it. Exactly. They they understand what it's like to be blind and like they are going through some of the same things that I am so I can kind of like talk to them and ask them for advice and stuff. I'm doing everything that I want to do and I am not letting my disability get in the way. Oh my God, I'm giving you a hug. They say they're all too familiar with not being included. That's why as they revel in this camp experience, they wanted to share this message. Treat us like real people. Even though you might like have a disability, you're not you're not completely like disabled. We can do most anything if you like let us. Katie Crowther, TMJ4 News.